I'm Brooke Gianetti. And this is my husband, Steve, and we would like to welcome you to our home, Patina Farm, here in Ojai, California. We are a design team. I do interiors and Steve does architecture. We also do gardens together. We did all of that here at Patina Farm. We designed it uh, from an empty lot to what you will see today. We fell in love with it the moment we walked up. We saw the oak trees and the view and the proximity to the city and it took about three steps and we bought it. Patina Farm really was inspired by the history of Ojai. It has a history of old Spanish buildings and it also mixes in the agricultural background of Ojai. We mix those two things together with a love of Belgian and French architecture and tried to create something completely unique but that felt very much at home. So there's antiques that are built in in the kitchen. There's antique beams in the ceiling. We really tried to make it feel like it had, had been here forever. But unlike houses that were built long ago, our house has a more contemporary flow to it. All the rooms flow together and are more open, which allows you to kind of connect, not just to the rooms, but also to the gardens beyond. What's really spectacular is in the evenings, you can also see the Topa Topa Mountains as they turn into that famous Ojai Pink moment, which is really spectacular. Our bathroom is one of the um, spaces where you really feel like you're outside. Every morning, it's such an amazing experience to shower right out in the garden. We really wanted to pick plants where there was something to discover every month of every season. So like right now the wisteria is blooming and it just smells so incredible. And then after they kind of fade away, all the roses will come into bloom. My favorite thing about living uh, here at Patina Farm is the connection to nature. We are surrounded by so much beauty and that's why we really designed this house this way to really be able to be connected to all the gardens. We have a lot of animals here. Our goats and sheep and cows here have really become a big part of our life and our daily experience. It's really been life-changing for me. It just allowed me to kind of slow down and be in the moment. We have our own water, we have our own power, we have backup batteries. So we can actually live off the grid here in a very beautiful way. We have both put our heart and soul in this property for the past 12 years, if you include the time that we were dreaming of how we were gonna live here. It's been a wonderful place to live. We'll be sad to see it go, but we just want somebody to live here that enjoys it as much as we do. And we know they will.